Hello, evening. I'm Howling Me with the band Neon Scan. Today I'm going to talk to you about the lyrics to our mini album Del Wish. We will start with the opening track when Helpless is over. This song is our introduction track to the band and the album, and the words speak for themselves. Our main influence was coming from where we used to live, in which we had a very stressful and draining experience. So much so that before we left to move elsewhere, we wrote this song. Its main title is self explanatory, as the old saying goes. We would only do something when health is over. I will emerge from my shell and take on my truest form is how we felt when we were quite stuck in the home we lived in and how we went from being fixed in one place to making the choice to go. The rest of the lyrics are similar to a rebirth of oneself and making decisions to change the scene for the better. The next track on the album Delwish, Neon Witch. Neon Witch is an influence from a lot of Pinterest posts on pagan witchcraft. It's an interest for us to throw in a type of fantasy character, one in which is very much of this time. After having seen the candle altar set up some bright pink crystals that have made it a resurgence today, we wrote this to describe the modern witch. I had a picture in my mind of this young woman in a plain black 60s swing dress and go-go boots, a big brimmed hat and pastel makeup, whilst vaping and driving through the city. We added this aesthetic to a sisterhood to which she belongs to. Lines like, I into the circle of light is where she wants to be, free your gossiping lips, why won't they leave? Is a description of wanting to be a real witch, with the light representing the true pagan, and that the gossiping false witch of the modern era. An interesting note to add is that we wrote this in the dark during the blackout, so perhaps that added some ambience. The third track on the album is Return from Tomorrow. This came about when we were watching a lot of time travel stories and wanted to write a short song about this. It describes a person who finds a time fabric of time, so to speak, falls into our time. The idea was having this car of the future while colliding into a tear, and that person turning us of the future. My electric tear brought me to you, fabric of time broken. The distortion on the vocals was purposely there to give an idea of a faint broken voice coming through into this future. It was more centred around the song than voice alone adding to the story. The one influence this tear did come from was actually playing Bioshock Infinite a lot. The last track on the album is called Unplanned End. This is a simple story of a couple split by the distance of the world in the 1700s. It's focused on a person of Western Europe, think of the other who is now in the Americas. They speak of the choice that they made and how lonely that they both feel and it would have felt in that particular time period. As I leave it behind, so I can start again, as I leave them behind me for my unplanned end. The chorus explains this and how they feel with a sudden decision and what they see as an unplanned end. We'd like to thank you so much for all the support that we've had with the debut album, and we're glad that it was joined by many. We are working on another album, so keep watching our social media, Facebook and Instagram for the updates. And with that said, Rock on some technology, please.